Assalamu alaikum dear students, I hope you will be fine. In this video, I am going to teach you the topic related to trigonometric leveling. In a trigonometric leveling, we will study the case number second when the base of the object is not accessible and we are interested to find out the reduced level of those objects. So, we have the given data in which we have instrument station A, which is reading on benchmark 2.16. The angle of elevation hai from the instrument station A to the top of the building is 22 degrees. Our jo instrument station B is reading on benchmark 3.28. Our jo angle of elevation hai to the top of the building from the instrument station B is 14 degrees 35 minutes. Hai. Okay. Iske saath saath jo reduced level of benchmark is 150 feet. Hai. Our jo station A, our station B ke darmiyan distance hai, wo humare paas 70 feet hai. Now, yaad rakhe ke humare paas jo instrument station A, our instrument station B hai, uski reading on benchmark different hai. To uska matlab ye hai ke humare paas jo line of plane of collimation hai, of the instrument station A, our instrument station B, wo different hai. Okay? Our jo instrument station B ka line of plane of collimation hai, wo greater hai. The line of plane of collimation of the instrument station A. Okay. So now, if we are interested to find out the reduced level of the top of the building, but practically in field, we cannot measure this horizontal distance because the base of the object is not accessible. So, us ki liye humne theodolite ko at a D distance set karna hai. Our jo reading on benchmark hai, usse note karna hai. Thik hai? Our jo angle of elevation hai, from the instrument station A to the top of the building, usko bhi note karna hai. Now, we have to ki that we have first case tha, jis mein humare paas base accessible tha, jis mein hum tangent theta ko use karte te, our direct is h ko find kar sakte te. Like now, humare paas ye d distance jo hai, wo unknown hai, to uski liye humne theodolite ko at a d distance set karna hai, our humare paas jo reading on benchmark hai, उसको नोट करना है अवर जो एंगल ऑफ एलिवेशन है फ्रॉम द इंस्ट्रूमेंट स्टेशन बी उसको भी नोट करना है ठीक है सो नाउ अगर हमने रिड्यूस लेवल ऑफ द टॉप ऑफ द बिल्डिंग फाइंड करना है तो सबसे पहले हम इंस्ट्रूमेंट स्टेशन ए और इंस्ट्रूमेंट स्टेशन बी के درمیان डिफरेंस को फाइंड करेंगे सो ये डिफरेंस हमारे पास क्या होगा अगर हम लाइन ऑफ प्लेन ऑफ कॉलिमेशन ऑफ द इंस्ट्रूमेंट स्टेशन बी से माइनस करें line of plane of collimation of the instrument station A so we can get the value of HD ok so now if we take this upper triangle and calculate the value of this H then we can easily calculate the reduced level of the top of the building by taking the value of benchmark plus the value of line of plane of collimation of the instrument station A plus the value of H so now to calculate the value of this H, we have a formula that D plus HD cotangent beta cross tangent alpha cross tangent beta whole divided by tangent alpha minus tangent beta. Now, we have the K, that we have the formula that we have the value hai, wo instrument station A and instrument station B ke distance. Hai. Our jo HD ki value hai, wo humne calculate ki hai 1.12. Tangent alpha ki value bhi hume given hai, tangent beta ki value bhi hume given hai. So now if we put all the value in this formula, so we can get the value of H. So now we can easily calculate the reduced level of the top of the building by taking the value of benchmark plus the value of HA plus the value of H. So we can get the reduced level of the top of the building. So this is our today topic. I hope you will be learn something new from this lecture. If you have any question related to this topic, please comment on my channel. I will try to reply your answer. So see you in next video. Thanks for watching. Allah Hafiz.